What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we will be opening up the Fairy Rise Japanese Booster Box. Uh, this set originally came out in August of 2018 and primarily features a variety of Psychic, Fairy, and Grass type Pokemon. Um, eventually in the English uh, variation it came out in the Celestial Storm Packs. Uh, there's a few gold cards, a few rainbows, and that whole thing, but we're going to jump right into it. I'm only going to open about half of the packs today. Um, I'm going to open the secondary uh, portion of it in a later video because just 15 packs is a lot to go through. Um, but this is what the art looks like, and here's the box. You have all the cards on the side, which obviously I cannot read. But if any of you are Japanese or are Japanese viewers or anything like that, you can you know, toss your comments on how to actually pronounce these Pokemon in the comments or, you know, send me a message. I know the Pokemon names in Japanese and other languages are generally pronounced different. So like Charizard is not Charizard. I think it's like Lizandro or something like that. Um, but we are going to jump into the Fairy Pack, Fairy Rise Booster Box um, set. We're going to do half of it. Um, each box is 30 packs, but each pack is only about five cards. Um, and it's 60 cards, it's a 60 card set, so it's gonna be pretty easy to fill out most of the cards in the set, um, but getting chip cards can be a little bit difficult. But getting pulls out of these uh, Japanese cards is usually a lot more fun because you get a lot more in the set. Um, I don't know how many I'm supposed to pull right off the bat, so I'm just gonna open them up and see how many I get. Um, I'm gonna name some of them. I don't know all the Pokemon because I haven't been keeping up with the newer, newer stuff. I have a lot of old generation knowledge, but um, we're just gonna go into it. I think this is a Yamask, Ninikad, Fairy Charm, I think, or Dragon Charm, and a Wigglytuff. Ah, we got a, I think it's a Moral, Trico, a Trainer Bag or something like that, and a Holographic Shamey. Shaman, Shamey, and Spell Tag? I think it's a Spell Tag. I don't know, it makes sense if it's a Fairy or Psychic type, if that's a Spell Tag. Uh, Cascoon or a Silicoon. Ooh, who is this guy? Um, uh, Litwick, Litwick, I think that's a Litwick. Uh, Carbank, uh, Con, Con, Confargius? Conflargus? He's the Coffin Mummy guy. And, I think this is Mina, I believe. Man, this is really testing my knowledge of Pokemon. I haven't actually played any of the games in, in a long time, especially some of the newer stuff. We have a Rumple, a Vul well, Lolan Vulpix, because it's the snowy one, and DD. Holographic, I think this is a Tapu Lele or Tapu Fini. I don't remember which one was which, because I've never played the Sun and Moon era. And a, I got Floby. I think, I don't know, but I think it's a phobia. Nice. All right, so two holographics, not too bad. Most of them have been different too, so we're filling out the set pretty well. And from the looks of it, it looks like the holographic is that fourth card, so I'm gonna take one off the top, and hopefully that should be at the back. So I have a Tang Growth, a Vespa Queen, a, ah, the little fly guy, the mosquito looking thing, I don't know what it is. Oh, Tangula, cool. And a fair up. Uh, a fist charm or a fighting charm, maybe? On the back, we have a netball or something, some sort of different Pokeball, a Kecleon, a Krillia, a uh, Ninjask, ooh, and a full art Alolan Ninetales card. Awesome, very, very nice. Oh, other side. Sweet. Well, you get to stay out here. Be a little special today. All right, so that's one. And that's one of the Pokemon on the box of the set, too. So it's kind of nice to get. We have a, I think this is a Beautifly. Um, Ralts. Sableye. A Jigglypuff. And a, um, ooh. I think this is a Meloda. Melody? Something like that. All right, so far not a lot of super deep pulls. I'm very, I'm honestly very surprised. I'm hoping the latter portion of this we get something because we're not getting a lot. Um, we got a Wigglytuff, um, Combi. I think this is a Morlol, Morlol, I think. 
Ninicod, and a holographic Giratina. Very nice. I always love the holographics in the Japanese sets because they're not as like in your face because they have the uh, just the holographic trim on the side. I think that's really nice. Subtle touch. A Grovile. Oh, there's a Sceptile in the set. I forgot. Oh, I have no idea. Shin, Shin, Shinatok? Shintotic, I think. Um, Chandler, or I think. Another trainer bag and a Psychic Charm, I assume. Top. We have a uh, Shid Ninja, Carbank, Trico, Yamask, and a Spell Tag. Ooh, man, these are this is a rough, rough box. I am so surprised. In the past, when I've opened up Japanese booster boxes, I'm usually pulling crazy, crazy good pulls that are left and right. I think that's the Dragon symbol, so I think it's a Dragon Charm. Another Vespa Queen, a Litwick, a Rumple. And a holographic, like I said before, either Tapu Fini, Tapu Fene, or whatever, and the Tapu Lele. I don't, I don't remember which one was which. So of this right now, we only have four left. Surprisingly, we've only gotten one pull. Let's hope we get something in these last four packs, because it's looking kind of bleak. Pori, it's been uh, very lackluster. Hopefully that second half is something decent. In the back, we have, I think this was Mina, a Lowland Vulpix. Cascoon or Silicoon, Kecleon, and that floaty B evolution that I still don't know. One off the top. Another Wiggly Tough, Ralts, Tangrowth, or not Tangrowth, I'm sorry, Tangela, the B guy, and a holographic Gardevoir. Oh, dropped him. Gardevoir, very nice. All right, two more packs. Still only one pull. I am, I am genuinely surprised. Usually get something more out of this. Uh, Tangrowth, Ninjask, Morlul, Trico, and a Fighting Charm. Boy, this has been a rough video, y'all. Rough video. Hopefully this last pack Magic in the Fair Eyes, half the Fair Eyes set, is gonna do something good. Uh, Psychic Charm, Jiggly Puff, a Sableye, Krillia, and all right, we got something in that last pack magic. We got a full art uh, Sceptile card. All right, way to end on a strong note when we started it on a really strong note too. That middle part was kind of kind of rough though, but in the end, we got two decent pulls. We pulled the Alolan, uh, Alolan Nightales GX card and the uh, Sceptile full art GX card as well. Very nice. Thanks everyone for joining into this video. I will be opening up the second half of the Fair Rise pack in the next one. I just didn't want the first one to be super long since these are 30 packs per box. But tune in for the next half and hopefully we get some more pulls aside from the Alolan Ninetales and the Sceptile cards we pulled in this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, ring the bell. You know what to do. Uh, but thank you again and we'll see you on the next one.